Well, there you go, folks. Out for another camp. Well, I reckon I can uh, get in here. No one can lay in there, no. All building going on there. So we'll uh, a little industrial units. a site that I haven't been to for a while. And I used to come in from the top end up over there when I lived on the estate. Loads of dead wood in here which is great for the fire. So I did have the tent, I think. I think well, I did have the tent here years ago. I mean, this is going back about four or five years. I think I had the tent in here by this tree. I'm sure that's why I had the tent in there. But we're going to go up further up there. Which is the old naffy block remains from the army camp. So I'll see you when we get up there. I'll set Brican on there. That's nice me coffee there. All ready to go. And here we are. That's it, I'll have a hammock between that sycamore and that old hawthorn there. And uh, you see this was a army base that was over there. And just in the woods over here, there's a flight of steps about eight foot wide about four or five steps. That was the entrance to the Naffy block. It's on the floor, there's stacks of this half burnt coal everywhere which come out from the Argus they cut the uh, soldiers' meals on. And there's a part of one of the huts there that's left of it, that's the roof vent. And so they just bulldoze a lot in, look, you can see it all stuffed in the, in the ground over here, look. All buried in. Your window frames here. Big old metal brackets, all sorts of stuff in here. And over here, is There's some of the old waterworks that there. Brick pit there. My mate dug that out a few years ago to expose it. So, so that would be the water main into the Naffy block. So that's uh, this is my hotel for the night. Absolutely lovely. One more time. 
top. <coughs> Peapot. And all the other bits in there, so we'll get the uh, all the kit set up. There we are folks all set up. For the night.
what we have there folks is just grab these up we can it's a pop crane goes on there the stick in the ground firmly over the fire and then you can lower it like so that's those notches a simple pot crane for two two sticks <sighs> love it thought I'd show you my uh, little bushcraft axe very old this is it was made in England So when I got this, this is very old, this is over 50, 60 years old, this axe head. And I uh, ground it down, got all the rust off of it, sharpened it up, put a new handle in it. And a friend of mine, Tommy, done the leather work around the uh, hilt of the handle there. So it's a lovely old axe, much better quality metal. And the ones you get these days. There's the little campfire burning away nicely there, folks. Soon be uh, ready to get some grub on. Well, let's get the mosquitoes down a bit as well. There's a loads of mosquitoes here earlier. I've got some jungle formula bug spray. And, uh, let that burn down a bit. Get some uh, ashes. Get some uh, cooking going. Well, that's for uh, dinner folks I'm just going to heat it up in the pan here with some hot water and with it some sweet corn just drain a bit of that out of that moisture that does look rather nice though Eat 
lovely. There it is, folks, on the pot crane there. I like so. There she is. That heat through. And there's dinner done. And that's been simmering away now for five to ten minutes, so that should be heated through nicely. Absolutely delicious. Very simple device to pot crane. You can see it's just a series of notches so you can hang like so. And then one the other way around on the bottom to hang the, the billy can on. That's for tea. Well coffee actually. Absolutely delicious. That um beef and red wine with lentils was bloody lovely, really nice. So that should be up into a boil in a minute or so. Morning viewers, lovely night's kip. I fell asleep in the chair actually by the fire last night, woke up about half two in the morning. <laughs> oh dear, better get in the hammock. But a beautiful day. So I'm going to strike all this down, tidy up and uh, make my way back. So until the next overnighter, see you soon viewers. <laughs>